Hello everyone, welcome back to Two Minute Tips. Let's get started. Today we'll be learning about the three different names Qualtrics projects have. We'll also be looking at where to find the option to change each of these names. Let's begin by heading over to our projects page and changing the project name of our survey. We can do this by clicking these three dots, selecting rename project and entering our new desired name. Please keep in mind that project names are only displayed in Qualtrics and will not be displayed to respondents at any time. Now let's go to our survey builder and take a look at another way to change project names. You'll notice two locations where this name is currently displayed, on the top left corner and above the survey editor. If we click right here, we can change the name and you can click anywhere outside of the text field to save it. Now let's take a look at the survey header. This name can be displayed to respondents if you want it to be. Let's go to the look and feel menu and select the general tab. Once we're there, we can enter the header content directly into the text box or Click edit to access the rich content editor. Please keep in mind that the survey header will be displayed at the top of each page in the survey. It also doesn't have to only be letters. It can be an image or logo. Once you're ready, click apply to save it. The last name we'll go over is the display name. This is the text that appears on your browser tab near the top section of your browser window. To change the display name, we'll need to head over to survey options, select the general tab and enter in our desired text in the text field below. Now that we've made all of our changes, let's publish the survey, copy the link, and open it up in a new tab to ensure that the names are showing up as expected. Sure enough, here's our survey header, and if we look up here, we'll also be able to see the new display name. And that's it! Thank you for learning how to rename your survey with me today. Please remember to subscribe to the 2 Minute Tip category on the XM community so you never miss a video, and I hope to see you around the XM community.